Good evening, America. How the fuck are you all doing tonight? I got a really fucking important message. And, uh, yeah, it's uh, really, really important. As you excel through life, as you continue to climb the ladder in business, fitness, whatever it may be, if you are not attracting and picking up haters, you're doing something terribly, terribly wrong. If you do not have haters, you are doing something terribly, terribly wrong. Because the fact of the matter is, is that when anybody in any industry or with any given skill excels at something to such a great degree, human nature is to hate on that person because you don't have that or you don't think that they deserve it or you think that they're a jackass because a lot of people think that they're a god and that they can judge and pick the way that other people could, could live their lives and should live their lives. But the fact of the matter is, is that there is no good, bad, right, wrong, or indifferent. There simply is. There simply is. And what may be good for you may not be good for somebody else. And what may be good for somebody else may not be good for you. So how can we as individuals look at another person and hate on them and disrespect them and dislike them because they're not living life to your fucking standards? Wow. I got a theory on it. People are so fucking miserable and they are so disgusted with their own lives that the only way that they can get out of their bullshit is to focus on other individuals. And look at what other individuals are doing. And criticize and hate on other individuals. Right? Kind of made a new mantra, right? So, I'm gonna be wearing uh, superhero shit from now on, right? Because I like the superhero shit. Superman, Batman, Green Lantern, whatever it may be. You'll see me in all kinds of Superman gear. I'm probably gonna buy a Spider-Man suit and start doing videos in that. So look, look for that, it's gonna be fucking awesome. Why? Because I don't give a fuck, right? All I care about is my purpose. God put me on this green fucking earth to educate Americans about proper health and nutrition. Why do I know this? Because when I aligned with this purpose, life became easy. Everything became so much easier. And it isn't like work for me. It's what I love doing. I love helping people. I love showing other people how to accomplish their goals and their dreams. I love setting people on fire. That's what I was born to do. But the fact of the matter is, is that you were born to do something different. And maybe you were born to do something similar. But we're all different individuals. We all have 37.5 trillion different fucking cells. And so if you are one of those people, which, and I'm not judging you for being them, that's fine if you are, but if you are one of those people that consistently and constantly puts judgment on another individual, I encourage you to look in the fucking mirror and ask yourself if you have these same issues that you're pointing fingers at. Because the fact of the matter is, is that what's good for somebody may not be good for somebody else. So, when you are truly excellent at what you do, you will know because you will have a massive amount of haters. You will have a massive amount of people criticizing the way that you go about things. And most of those people are lazy as fuck sitting on the couch, which is fine. They can be lazy as fuck if they want. I'm not judging, but they're lazy as fuck sitting on the couch watching life through a TV or a Facebook screen or whatever it may be, analyzing, judging, and criticizing other people's lives. Let them do it because somebody's got to, right? So the message today is do you have a shitload of haters? Do you have a bunch of haters? If you don't, 
you're doing something fucking wrong. This is Tyson James Lee reminding each and every one of you to get up, take action, go after what you want in life and be about that action boss.